Hey guys, this is a really short video I have for you today. And my issue that I've had with this guitar since I've gotten it is really the volume knob. And what can happen when you're playing Stratocasters is you're, you're constantly strumming right here in this area and your hand just wants to hit the volume knob all the time. And for me personally, it always started turning down the volume when I really didn't want it to. So what I've done was went to the local Ace Hardware store here in town, and I just bought some really small washers, probably about the size of a nickel. And what I did was took off the volume knob, which is right here, and the washers just simply sit underneath this volume knob. And when I push down on it, the extra thickness of the rubber washers, it has a good way of just adding pressure to that knob to where it doesn't turn as easy. So now when I play, you know, I can hit that volume knob all I want and it's not going to move. Now I can still move it. It's just a little harder to turn, which is perfectly fine. I'm not really the kind of player that does a lot of volume swells with the volume knob with my pinky. And if I'm going to do anything like that, it's going to be some kind of auto swell kind of function, either on my head rush or my line six HX effects or any other auto swell unit that you might have. And with the other two knobs, which are tone knobs, I don't do a whole lot with those because um, my hand is just not there to hit the knobs a lot. So I'm not too worried about that. I do try to keep my tone knob about three or four because this bridge pickup is a little bright, but really that's not too bad. My main concern is just the volume knob and not having it turn so much when I play. So I think it's gonna work out great. Been doing lots of jamming with it and it really just stays in place just like I want. And it works out really well. So if you wanna try the solution on your Stratocaster, then go ahead and go to your local hardware store. And you can either find some felt washers or some rubber washers, uh, just a little bit smaller than the diameter of the volume knob here. And so that way they'll be hidden and they won't stick out too much and they'll do the job of keeping your volume knob in place. So if you've liked this kind of content, be sure to subscribe down below and click the bell. And until next time, I'm Dr. McFarland. I will see you in the next video. Keep rocking.